for final approach 13 minutes. Still nothing on the comms. Roger that. Wow, so that's Eden, huh? It really is as beautiful as the brochure makes it out to be. Focus, Jay. We need to find out why the colony communications went dark. Fire? Technical glitches? Corporate sabotage? Just crappy reception? Shit, I don't think they'd be sending in the guys with the guns if it was just crappy reception. We've got a targeting lock from the colony defense systems. They're firing at us! Jay. Please identify yourself. Lieutenant Nora Harwood, Everreach Industries, Security Division. Unauthorized user, please remain still. Anybody? Jay, you're all right. Nora, Mike, Mike is... I know. He was right there, and, and then he just blew up. One shot, just like that. We can't focus on that right now. We need to regroup. What's your position? I've never seen someone die right in front of me. I can't believe it. It was just... It was just... Technician Rockwell, report. What's your current status? Sorry, just minor injuries, Lieutenant. The cockpit took the brunt of the impact. You're still in the ship? For now, but with all this damage, there's no way to get it flying again. We need to rendezvous. What are your current coordinates? I don't know. The NAVCOM's destroyed. All I can see through the windscreen's forest. I'm gonna exit the craft and see if I can get my bearings. Make up. Jay? You're breaking up! Jay! Damn it! Something's jamming the signal. Whoa! 
Okay, right. Alien wildlife. Hope it's friendly. Are those the obelisk? Wow, they're even bigger than they looked in the vids. No wonder Everreach needed archaeologists here. Hold your fire! You're not from Eclipse. Who the hell are you? Lieutenant Nora Harwood, Everreach Security Division. My team and I were shot down by colony defenses. One of my men crash-landed further away. The other didn't make it. Were you the ones who fired on us? <sighs> no, but I can explain who did. Welcome to Nova Outpost. I'm Lieutenant Abigail Ross, Colony Security and Logistics. Did they tell you much about this place in briefing? I read the reports. Multiple luxury settlements tailored for rich colonists on the first habitable planet we found in our galaxy. Maybe the only habitable planet besides Earth. Not like you see evidence of alien civilizations anywhere else, right? You mean those obelisks I saw on the way in? Yep, that and the runes. They're all over the place here, but whatever built them is long gone. Hard to believe we have actual proof of alien life now. It's big news. That's why Everreach sent a bunch of archaeologists with the Advanced Colony Team. Someone's got to study what's here. Tell me more about the Advanced Team. They're not colonists? <laughs> no. None of us could afford it. We're just getting the colony set up. So construction workers, technicians, scientists, you name it. There's about 200 employees working here. So, what happened? Until two weeks ago, everything was going great. We set up a bunch of different outposts all over the planet to build the different settlements and carry out local surveying. It was all on schedule, going as planned. And then, one day, without any warning, the main outpost, Eclipse, launched a full-on attack on us. They reprogrammed their drones, jammed all local and interplanetary communications, sent in infantry, you name it. Let me guess. They're the ones who fired on us? 
Considering they're the ones controlling the big surface tear cannons, I'd say pretty likely. What do they want? Why are they attacking? They haven't said, but, well, Everreach has more than a few corporate rivals that would love to see this colony initiative fail. You're thinking corporate sabotage? Makes sense. Bribery, spies. It's got to be pretty organized to have a whole settlement in on it, not to mention trying to kill us. How are you guys holding up? Not great. We lost a bunch in the initial attacks. Most of us haven't had a proper sleep in days. They attack us so regularly that we can't even take a break or arrange a counterattack. We're running out of everything. Food, fuel, medical supplies, you name it. We won't last much longer at this rate. Is there anywhere you can find more supplies? There's a construction site a little ways from here that would have some of the things we need. But it may as well be back on goddamn Mars. We can't get to it by foot, and the only vehicle we have that's still running is a single rider hover bike. I'd have to send one person out alone, into hostile territory. These people don't have the right military training for field combat. It'd be a death sentence and a waste of resources. I can't make that call. But now, you do have someone with military training. What do you need me to do? Well, I would need you to head over to the construction site and explore the area. Pick up whatever supplies you can find, then bring them back here. Will there be any field support? Well, communications will be jammed, so we can't help you directly. But there is someone who can. Go check in with our technician bot, 73Q. She'll get you set up. I have to go refortify our positions and check in with the guards. When you're done, meet me in the map room, and I'll give you the coordinates. Go away. Sorry. Excuse me, are you 73Q? Affirmative. Scanning unknown user for company identification. Ever reach employee status? Confirmed. Welcome to Nova Outpost, Lieutenant Nora Hardwood. I am Everreach branded technician support platform 73Q. My friends call me 73. Current number of friends is zero. Uh, okay. Abigail told me to report in with you? Affirmative. Lieutenant Abigail Ross. Confirmed new orders. I stand ready to assist you in technical and field support. What kind of field support? I gather communications aren't working. That is correct. Good job. You get a cookie. Huh? Communications are indeed inoperable, but I will accompany you on location to provide local logistics and support. I can also provide relaxing music. Hey, are you okay? You seem to be acting strangely. I mean, not to be rude, but are you always this bad at cracking jokes? Checking database. Negative. According to my records, I have only been bad at cracking jokes for 5 days, 6 hours, and 23 minutes. My apologies. A personality module was installed incorrectly and is providing inconsistent feedback for the context, timing, content, and phrasing of jokes. Please disregard all attempts at humor. My primary functions are unaffected. My scan shows you are currently using standard issue Everreach weapon and body armor. With the correct materials and technical skill, this equipment can be upgraded over standard specifications. I know. Usually my technician Jay handles on-the-fly upgrades, but uh, he's not here right now. You are in luck. I am able to interface directly with Everreach equipment and upgrade it using salvaged parts and raw materials. Allow me to demonstrate. Please open your main interface menu. Select the upgrade option. This is the upgrade interface. Each node represents a specific upgrade. Each upgrade will require certain materials to complete. You can salvage these materials in the field. When you have the materials, simply select which upgrade you wish me to complete. You already have some materials. Try selecting an upgrade now.
The upgrade is effective immediately. This will allow for seamless improvements to performance at any time. Recommend we resolve any remaining questions before meeting with Lieutenant Ross. What do you do here at the outpost? I provide faster diagnostics for colony systems, system reprogramming, and so on. I also handle some physical repairs on equipment. Won't it be an issue if you come with me? I mean, doesn't the outpost need your skills too? While I provide many technical and maintenance services, I only function in a support capacity for the human technicians at this outpost. They are more than capable of maintaining outpost integrity without my assistance. Also, they have expressed extreme annoyance related to my jokes repeatedly. We're likely to be going into combat, and I could use an extra gun. Do you have any kind of built-in defensive systems? I am only a technician bot. I was not programmed with combat subroutines or equipped with defensive mechanisms. Yes, but maybe there's something you do have that can be repurposed, like a laser drill or enhanced shielding. I have several screwdrivers. Right. If your personality module's malfunctioning, why not just stop telling jokes altogether? The module malfunctions result in unpredictable attempts at humor, which override cancellation. Unfortunately, only a full diagnostic can disconnect the module, and that cannot be done with Nova Outpost's equipment. How did you get a screwed up personality module in the first place? During a recent siege of the Outpost, Lieutenant Ross expressed frustration with my default behavior patterns. She cited possible morale issues due to, quote, that damn soulless box of tin. Lieutenant Ross was under much stress at the time. During a lull in combat, she attempted to install this module for more human-like relations. Lieutenant Ross is not a certified Everreach robotic service technician. That'll do. Let's get going. Excuse me, are you the specialist from Earth? That's right, Lieutenant Nora Harwood, Security Division. Right, uh, Julian Morgan, Global View News. A reporter? It was your company's idea. They wanted to embed a journalist on the advanced team. Guess they figured that this place was such a big deal that they wanted the world to know about it. Right, now I remember. I've seen some of your clips about the colony on the news stream. Yeah, well, I don't think this was the sort of exciting development ever each one of me reporting. Not that I can report on much while the communications are jammed. Are you all right? Yeah, it's been a rough couple of weeks, that's all. I've seen Ben through a lot of stuff. I'm very sorry to hear that, but I'm afraid I don't speak for Everreach or give interviews. Oh no, I wasn't going to ask for one. Hmm, well, if that's everything... Actually, there is something you could do for me. It might even help with your investigation. What do you mean? An entire outpost has gone rogue and started striking back against Everreach. That's, what, 40, 50 individuals taking part in this mutiny? There is a story there. I want to know more about the people involved in this uprising. Who they are, what they do, what their background is, and how they tie into this. The human beings behind this conspiracy. For that, I need their names and IDs so I can cross-reference them with the Everreach databanks. Home life, previous employment, that sort of thing. While you're out in the field, could you collect some of the dog tags from the Eclipse soldiers? It'd help a lot. All right. Oh, thank you. I'll uh, leave it up to you how you get the tags from them.
chips. Chips and chocolate. Oh, and melted cheese. 